Today, guys, we have some really important information we need to share about an engine oil recall. That's correct. You don't want to damage your engine, so stick around and find out just what's going on. Now, AMS Oil Synthetic Motor Oil versus Castrol Edge Extended Performance in a Copor test to start off and find out just how bad this recall really is. We all know about the lawsuits of the Dollar General Motor Oil. Do we have a repeat of the same case except a highly regarded brand? Now we'll take a look at the specifications. Both engine oils claim 100% guaranteed protection for your engine. Castrol Edge Extended Performance claiming to go for 15,000 miles or one year, whichever comes first. Now take a look at the AMS oil. They also guarantee protection for up to 25,000 miles. So this is why the engine oil recall is very important and you don't want to miss out. Finally, let's see which engine oil is the bad one. Castrol comes out with the edge in the cold bore test. Let's move on to the film strength test. What is the best oil for your engine? Make sure you drop a comment below and let us know what you think. We're finally finishing up the test. Now it's time for the moment of truth. Let's take a look at these bearings and check out the wear scars. Amsoil to the left, Castrol to the right. Now we're going to show you the weight of the bearings before performing this test. We kick off by calibrating the scale first to make sure we're 100% accurate. Castrol starting weight before 16.46 grams. Now it's time for the Amsoil. 16.49 grams. Now here we are. Let's calibrate the scale once again and check out the results after using the bearings in the film strength testing machine. I'm really excited to find out just what's going on with this engine oil recall. Castrol 16.44 grams. Now time for the AMS oil bearing. 16.43 grams. Let's show these in a side-by-side -side comparison. Guys, is there a recall? Please let me know. 0.2 grams loss for the Castrol, 0.6 gram loss for the AMS oil. Maybe there is no recall. Maybe Castrol's just better. Thanks for watching Nate's Interactive Auto.